Hey guys, welcome back to the Blind Matrix YouTube channel and this week's weekly update. Please remember to hit that subscribe button, the notification bell, leave some comments. Let's get started. First up is the notification link. You can add notifications via the main Blind Matrix control panel. And when a new notification has been added, you'll see the word new just here. And if you click on it, you'll see the notification that has been sent from the company to your trade customer using the online ordering portal. You've also got a banner here that you can configure from the main Blind Matrix application. And if you click on this cog just here, you can now see the trade account holders details just here. When you create new and click on the customer tab, you have a few more delivery address options. You have the default, which is the standard delivery address for the trade customer. You can now also enter in the end customer address, which is good for drop shipping. And as usual, you have the alternate delivery address just here. And now we have the additional price details available on the list by product screen. It's available both on the search page and the works in progress page. If you scroll to the right, you'll see what I've done here already. You can see that I've got net price and net override, gross price, gross override, discount, gross profit and gross percentage and VAT columns. Some of these columns were not previously available. For example, net override and gross override. They're now available at product level. And that's really helpful for you to see where price adjustments have been made. And you can edit this by clicking on the custom column screen. And just a reminder as well that it's also available on the list by order tabs, both on the works in progress and on the search page. I've set it up a little earlier. Again, here you can see net price. You've got total cost price there, list price, net price, net override, gross override, discount, VAT, gross profit percentage and gross profit. What this enables you to do is actually, again, see where the price adjustments have been made. So you can see the net override, gross override, and also discounts. And that enables you to make sense of the gross profit percentage and gross profit figures. And again, the way that you can figure that is by clicking on the custom columns. And finally, guys, what we have here is some modifications we've made to the customer details page. If you scroll down, you'll now see that there's actually additional email boxes. So you can put multiple company emails into this screen just here. Well, guys, that was this week's weekly update. Please leave us some comments and let us know what you found useful. Until next time, goodbye.